All right, so for Dan's program, what we're gonna do is we added in just, uh, well, his, his program has uh, adductors and glutes will be the foam roll session. And so what we've done is we added in, I added in one little calf rolling using the softball of the Fit4 foam roll system that I have. And we just did a little bit of the lateral gastroc, peroneal complex, and just did kind of an active release where he just used his toe. And now we're gonna get into the adductor and all I have him doing is gripping his, his adductor against that and he slides and kind of rolls back and forth using one to facilitate the superficial fascial and the, the skin, move the skin and the fascia and then get into the, the deep aspect of the tissue to help release some of the tenderness in that area. Yeah. All right, so what we're doing, adding in this foam roll is using the softball, so the Fit4 complex Fit4 system actually has a softball that we can use. And so I have him on an outside, and then I'm using his foot, and he's just doing kind of an isometric where he'll pull up and in. And then some of the things that I can do is actually use my hand and give him a little bit of resistance so he's pulling up and in. As long as he doesn't have too much tension or pain in that particular, and then we let, let him relax. So just giving him a little bit of tissue manipulation and then a little bit of active right. release. Right there. Right there. Right there. That's <laughs> the spot right there. So again, doing some of the lateral rib just to help his thoracic spine move a little bit. Find that area right around the serratus anterior. Just kind of gently moving and massaging the tissue. Very subtly. Okay. So the program calls for a primarily static stretch, but what I'm doing is taking Dan into a static stretch, which would be more for the ankle hip complex, and I'm adding in some thoracic spine by just having some, so it's kind of a mobilizer, a stretch position with a mobilizer for the thoracic spine, which obviously will facilitate the lateral line on that same side to help free up the tissue. And now, Dan, what I'm going to have you do is you come back out, is you come down, and I'm going to have you open up that way, right. So we're going to put a little rotation into it and then come back up and then over. Perfect. So all I'm doing is in a static stretch position is facilitating a little mobilization, tissue mobilization by going into the frontal and transverse plane. So that's the only little heroics that we're doing for him today. What that does is will help facilitate thoracic spine mobility, hip mobility in the frontal and transverse plane as well as the sagittal and it also works for his ankle so as he rotates laterally he gets a different motion at the ankle and as he rotates into transverse plane this way it'll create a little bit more supination so that's the heroic we did for him on that stretch today